Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. This is Single Mom's Life and I am in Walmart and today we're going to be doing another grocery haul. And also I may document a little bit what the shelves are looking like. It shouldn't be too bad or anything because it's been pretty much looking really, really good in here. So I may document some, I may not, I don't know. Uh, I'm just gonna check things out and see what things are looking like first. But stick around and see what I get on my grocery haul this week, y'all. Pull up section looks good, y'all. Looking good over there. The bleach is looking good. Just a little empty, but for the most part, it looks good. They are stocked back up on their cleaning supplies. Cleaning supplies is looking good over here. Pepper towers are looking good. Toilet paper is looking good, y'all. They are st stocked up on toilet paper. They have plenty of bacon and eggs, y'all. They have plenty of milk product. There's a lot of stuff out, y'all, so I can't get too close. They have plenty of water in here, y'all. Plenty of water. With the exception of a few empty areas, but for the most part, they do have plenty of water in here. They do have a lot of buns, but of course, um, it is 4th of July weekend, so they do have some of those missing. But as far as the regular bread, y'all, they have plenty of the regular bread. Plenty cereal, y'all. They have plenty cereal in here. Yeah, I got my baby with me, y'all. But yes, they have plenty cereal. They have chicken, y'all. Not a whole lot, but they do have chicken. They do have pork. Prices of this stuff, y'all, definitely have went up. That is crazy on how much this meat has went up, y'all. For the most part, y'all, everything is looking pretty good. Looks pretty stocked, with the exception of a few empty areas. But I mean, they can't stay fully, fully stocked because people are constantly in and out grocery shopping but for the most part everything looks really good in here y'all okay y'all the soup owl looks good as well and as usual the produce owl looks good y'all plenty of produce okay so i'm back home from my grocery haul y'all i didn't get a really a whole lot of stuff but um I there's a couple things I did get that I did not lay out. I got some greens because we're having some greens um, for Fourth of July, and also I didn't lay out the cornmeal or anything either. But this is what I got from Walmart. I got some bread, Star Crunch, two cans of corn, some cheese. Um, I got some icing, the cream cheese kind. That's because I'm going to bake a cake, y'all. Red velvet. Um, also, I got some pears because my baby loves pears and he's been asking for pears. I have some milk, um, bottle of Coke, six pack of Cokes. I got three Gatorades, two containers of chips, um, some macaroni because I'm having some macaroni and cheese. I'm not having my standard from 4th of July, y'all. We're going to have some greens, macaroni and cheese, cake, ribs, chicken. Um, I didn't want no potato salad or baked beans because I had cooked that for Memorial Day, so I really don't have a taste for that. So we're doing something different. Um, got some apples for my baby. 
Um, some chips, barbecue sauce, two things of Jiffy, some water, some Frosted Flakes. We have two packages of bacon, y'all. Uh, also, I got some bananas for my baby. Two rolls of hamburger meat, y'all. And this stuff has went up. And this is the cheapest roll. And it was like $5, y'all. It is ridiculous on how much this ground beef costs, right? Even the ribs. These ribs, y'all, were $13 for these country-style um, ribs. And usually, I don't pay that much for ribs. But the meat... Prices has definitely gone up. But anyway, um, this is everything that I got on my grocery haul. Um, and I'm going to tell you how much I spent on this stuff. Just give me a sec because I got to subtract the non-food items that I got as well. Okay, y'all. So how much did I spend on my grocery haul this week? I spent $79.85, which is not bad because I really didn't get a whole lot of stuff because I still have plenty of meat in my freezer that I need to cook. But um, $79.85, y'all, that's, that's good. But anyway, that was my grocery haul for this week. The shelves, they looked really good. Um, they had plenty of meat in the store. So I think things are getting a little bit back normal in terms of the um, empty shelves. So, um, but it, it did look good. But anyway, I thank y'all for watching. I thank y'all for subscribing. I thank y'all for the uh, wonderful comments and the thumbs up. Please keep it coming. Um, thank you for watching. And y'all have a blessed and wonderful day. Bye-bye.